Well, here's what I got so far. This is my uh, lizard habitat. I've got it. The bottom is veed, so that valve, I can open that valve up right there and drain all the waste product that soaks down through this. Uh, there's a uh, egg crate down here that's going to be the surface, the bottom. And I did not want a piece of wood in the middle, so I split these doors in half, but I put it at an angle so that will actually lock. We'll put a lock up here, and that will lock this door shut. So, I'm going to open it up here. This, this uh, opening will allow me easy access for cleaning. I just did a water test on the waterfall. It's really cool. I don't have the pump hooked up yet, but the water comes there, comes down, drops down, comes down, comes down, and then ends up down in this area right here. These little platforms will be covered with rocks. And as you can see, the grating that's down inside, it's, uh, you can easily remove it if you'd like to clean the bottom out better. Uh, this was background was made with styrofoam and grout. Uh, the cabinet is made with three-quarter inch birch plywood and really good pine, solid pine. Here's a side view of it. And then the back view. The back view, you see the pipe, that's going to come from the filter up to the top of the waterfall, and that will be your water circulation. I still have to put lights on it, heat lamps, UV light, I put the uh, fake and real plants inside of there. Uh, this is two days worth of work, start to finish, so far. I will get a video whenever I uh, get this thing running. Uh, we're going to close this, and this will keep this latched here like that. And then we're going to have a latch that I'm going to put up in this area right here. So that way you're not looking at two inches and two inches of metal framework right here. You can actually see inside of there. One note, if you do this and cut this at an angle, this area right here is as sharp as a razor blade. I took a file. After I sliced my finger open, I took a file and uh, smoothed that down. Very sharp, so be careful. I encourage anybody and everybody to uh, come up with your own little plans here. Make, uh, make something interesting, something that's your own personality. I uh, have not seen this in the store. I did not duplicate it from anything. I created everything myself. I bent the plexiglass. I purchased everything, the wood and everything, and everything you see right there it's hand cut and homemade. Uh, so far I have about $200 invested in this project. And that's it. I'll send another video when I get the plants and stuff in there.